forgive Mr. Trudeau for what we're seeing, and now we're seeing a third incident? It's not for me to forgive. It's for Canadians to forgive him uh, if they choose to or not. Uh, but I have to really point out what we're seeing now is an ongoing pattern of behavior that's really going to hurt Canadians. They're going to see the Prime Minister uh, mocking the realities that so many Canadians live with. And it is not a joke. Racism means that people are hurt physically, they're hurt mentally, they don't get the jobs that they need and want. It has hurt people in such a horrible way. It, not, it can never be something that's made light of. And I'm really more and more thinking about how much this is going to hurt Canadians to see more and more images coming out. It's just going to make that pain even deeper. It's going to make Canadians think about what they've gone through in their lives, how it's hurt them in their lives. And I want folks to really know that they are valued, they are loved, they have worth. Don't let these images make you question your own self-worth. You talk about a pattern. In your mind, what is different between one instance and two or three or this pattern as you're pointing out? Well, once something becomes a pattern, it's no longer isolated. It becomes proof of, of something that is real. That there is some examples here that are showing that Mr. Trudeau has has beliefs towards people that, that they are less than, that they're less worthy, that they're to be mocked or made fun of. And the example to me that is one of the most chilling is we've seen now multiple examples of blackface and brownface, anti-black racism and racism broadly. But when he, just last year, behind private doors, behind closed doors at a fundraiser, was confronted with protesters that said that their community in Grassy Narrows was being poisoned and had been poisoned with mercury for so long. When he laughed and mocked them by saying, thank you for your donation, that is a recent example of his treatment towards people that are going through a, a horrible crisis. The fact that he mocked them and made fun of them shows that he does not have compassion. He doesn't understand the pain of what people are going through. And a lot of Canadians are asking very serious questions about his sincerity right now. Two questions in French, de ma part, Monsieur Singh. D'abord, troisième instance où Monsieur Trudeau dans un vidéo euh, et en maquillage noir. Quand ça fait trois fois, est-ce qu'on peut dire que c'est une erreur de jeunesse? Après trois fois, ça, ça c'est quelque chose qui montre des valeurs. Une fois, on peut dire peut-être c'est une exemption, mais une exception. Mais qu'on en a trois fois, ça crée un, un message. Et le message maintenant que les Canadiens vont voir, c'est un message où on a le premier ministre du Canada qui se moque des gens. Et en fait, ce qui va arriver, on va avoir plusieurs Canadiens aujourd'hui qui vont penser des moments dans leur vie quand ils, où ils étaient insultés, ridiculisés et ça va faire du mal. Donc je encourage exigent tous les gens de toujours savoir qu'ils ont un mérite, une valeur et vous êtes aimé. Est-ce que vous pensez que M. Trudeau est raciste? Euh, C'est clair à ce moment que tous ces propos par rapport au multiculturalisme, la diversité, c'est maintenant en question. Et je sais que beaucoup, beaucoup de Canadiens ont des questions fortes pour le Premier ministre. Uh, ça manque, manque de sincérité et c'est aujourd'hui une tellement difficile journée pour beaucoup de Canadiens. Est-ce qu'il y a différents niveaux de racisme? Est-ce qu'il peut y avoir un racisme moins grave qu'un autre? À ce moment, c'est un, une journée difficile pour les Canadiens et je encore exige tous les Canadiens de savoir qu'ils ont une valeur, ils ont, une, ils ont mérité, ils ont aimé. Merci beaucoup.